Hello everyone, let me show you today how you can use Unminable to mine every crypto coin that you want. If you want to mine Bitcoin, Ethereum, even after the changes that just happened right now, you can still do it using Unminable. But before we start with the tutorial, don't forget to thank the sponsor of today's video. Keyfans. On keyfans.com, you can find cheap OEM license keys for Windows 10 and 11, Microsoft Office, and even games. By clicking on the link in the description, you will get an additional discount up to 62%. Stop paying an absurd amount of money for your keys and head to keyfans.com, add your desired software to your card, you can buy it using PayPal or credit card, and enjoy the promotion. Thanks, keyfans.com, for sponsoring this video. Now let's start right into the tutorial. Go into the description down below where you're going to find the web link to onminable.com. Once you are here, you're going to see the mine website where it's going to show you all the different crypto coins and tokens that you can start mining with your PC or with your gaming PC as long as you are not using it. That is something that depending on the electricity cost where you live, it could be worth it for you to do. As you can see, you can mine a lot of different coins. For example, Ethereum, Cosmos, Cardano, a basic addition token, that is the cryptocurrency that you can also earn by using the web browser Brave. If you don't know how to make it, guys, I will let you right here one link to a video to show you how to do it. Now you can also mine Bitcoin, uh, Dash, and a lot more Litecoin, and a lot of more different coins that you see right here. Now, for this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make it with Ethereum, but it's going to be almost the same for every other coin. Click into the coin that you want to mine. And now you can make it already with any of the miners that you see right here. And even with a mining app that Unminable have made themselves. If you don't know how to make it with all of this because you are new to this subject, you can click right here to get started with our wizard. Click on it. And now you have two different modes. That is the basic and the advanced one. Click into the basic to start. And from here it's going to ask you what mining hardware do you want to use? If you have a dedicated GPU in your PC, what I recommend you guys is to take the GPU. It's what is going to give you more hashes and it's going to work better for whatever you want to mine. If you don't have it, you can also use the CPU or you can also use both, but CPU isn't really worth it too much. So select your GPU. And now right here, you're going to need to select your mining algorithm that you want to use. And that is based depending on how much GPU memory you have in your system. If you don't know how much VRAM your graphic card have, what you can do is to right click into the start button and go into device manager. Once this small window open, you can go into your display adapters and you can see the model of graphic card that you have. Now what you can do is to search in Google for that model of graphic card and to look how many VRAM this one have. Now you can see that you have to have more than six gigabytes, more than three gigabytes and everything else. For me, I'm going to select Capo for this time. Click on it. And now you want to select your coin or token that you want to mine. As I said before, we're going to select Ethereum for this tutorial. Now, right here, you are going to need to enter your wallet address. You have to make sure that it's an ETH address. If you insert anything like a Bitcoin or any other coin address in here, it's not going to work and you're going to lose all the work that your PC is doing. Another small thing that I want to tell you guys before finishing this, that if you don't have a wallet address and you don't know how to make that, I'm going to make one video soon into the future, where I'm going to show you how to create a trust wallet account in your cell phone. And the best thing that you can do if you have a gaming PC is to make undervolting on your GPU. It's going to take way less electricity and it's going to be better for you. But this, I'm going to leave it for a video in the future. So now you want to enter right here your ETH address. Now, when you have already your address added right here, you want to click into next. Now you can use a referral code. If you have a referral code from a friend or if you are mining another coin, you can add it right here. And one percentage of what you win in Ethereum is going to be sent to that address. But for this tutorial, we are going to be continuing without a referral code. Now here, depending on the GPU that you have, you want to download the different miners. I can download the MB miner that is for NVIDIA and AMD GPUs, G miner is for both, and T-Rex that is only for NVIDIA. The first thing that you want to do is to click right here to download the .bat file. And now you want to download the miner files. 
a new window is going to pop up. You want to open the miner that is made for Windows if you're using a Windows computer or Linux, depending on the system that you're using. It's going to start downloading. You only have to wait a couple of minutes until this is done. Now you can open your download folder, right click into the miner and click into extract all. When this is done, you want to open the folder where you have your miner open up and you want to select the .bat file that we downloaded from Mineable, copy it and paste it into that folder. Now, all that you have to do to start mining is to double click into that .bat file. If you see one window that the window protected your PC because it's an unrecognized app, you want to click into more info and to click into run anyway. Now, as you can see right here, it's going to tell me that the Defender Firewall have blocked some feature of this app. You want to click into allow all and allow access. And now this is starting to mine with your graphic cards, Ethereum, or the coin that you selected from onminable.com. Now, when this already started to mine and you want to check how everything is going, you want to go back into the Omineable website and go into address. Right here, you want to enter the address that you used before for your miner. Click into search. As you can see right here, even if I'm mining right now, this doesn't show me anything right here. This is because it takes a little bit of time before this starts to show up. But after a couple of minutes, you are going to be able to see all the data right here. You are going to be able to select auto pay once a day with a minimum balance of 0.05 ETH. And this you can do the same for every coin that you choose. That is pretty much it, guys, for this tutorial. If you want to see how to get Trust Wallet or if you want to see how to underclock your GPU, don't forget to subscribe to watch these upcoming videos. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the content and you find it useful, don't forget to drop a like and a subscriber is more than welcome. See you guys on the next time. Bye bye.